another supply chain issue, a medication shortage affecting people who live with ADHD. 10 News reporter Amy Cochran spoke to a local medical expert on how to cope if your pharmacy is out of Adderall. Lewis Gale psychiatrist Dr. Nora Silver sees about 20 patients a day. She says the number of people affected by ADHD is larger than many people realize. For children, around 11% of the population and adults, the studies differ, but anywhere from 2.5 to approximately 5%. Dr. Silver says the disorder is becoming more and more recognized, which is one of the reasons why the medicine is in short supply. Staying on task, focus, attention, being able to organize one's day, it can really affect uh, a number of different areas in someone's life. If you are struggling to find the medicine at your local pharmacy, Dr. Silver recommends checking others, calling your doctor, and rationing medication on weekends or days you need it less. If you can't get your prescribed Adderall at all, she has a few more suggestions. As always, eating well, sleeping well, maintaining a, a strict schedule, those things can, can help exercise. She also advises people without their medication to let others know what's going on at school or work. It's a difficult time right now, but they are certainly working to increase those supplies. So be patient and hold on and, you know, it, it should hopefully be fixed soon. In Salem, Amy Cockrum, 10 News, working for you.